Okay, we got a, a lot of Homestuck fans now, thanks to uh, Austin's Namco High series. No pressure, no pressure. Let me start off by saying this is going to be more of a first impression than a review, because I'm only three acts in uh, Homestuck. I'm about to read the fourth one, I'll be doing it pretty soon. Um, and so far, so good. Like I said, it got me into a read three acts so far, and I enjoy it. I'm still new to this thing, and I can't call myself a fan yet, but I will say it's probably one of the most unique things I've ever seen on the internet. Being one of the most original things, and it's just one of those things that's so weird, yet so enjoyable. And now, I'm not like Austin or Mitzi, other people of the Duck Brigade who are really into Homestuck, but I can say I've enjoyed what I've read so far, and I've had a good time doing it. Now, I get that Homestuck's a comic and not really an animated series, so why am I doing it for this month? Well, first thing is first, it's definitely gone beyond a webcomic at this point. It's become extremely big, and it does have Flash animations in it. So, I'm gonna count it. Plus, it's really big. I mean, it's probably the biggest one of all the ones I decided to review. It got, like, I think over a million dollars for a Kickstarter video game. It has created one of the biggest fandoms of the internet. It's pretty damn big, and it's definitely worth taking a look at. So, so far, from what I've seen, I have not seen any of the trolls yet. I've been told by Austin, the AKA Namco High Guy, that it gets a lot better once you get to know the trolls, and that's one of the best parts about the series. So I'm a little bit behind. This is kind of just a so far so good thing in my opinion, but I'm sure it'll get better. But like I said, it's been it keeping me reading since the first act, so that's all that's really important. Now, I will say Act 1 was not very enjoyable, but I was told by other Homestuck fans that's not very, Act 1 isn't actually very good, but it gets a lot better, and by Act 2 I actually was finding myself enjoying it a lot more. Plus, I admit I've seen some pretty epic stuff on this series so far. Who do I recommend this to? Um, anyone who's willing to read a lot, and anyone who's willing to get past one born act for a bunch of good acts. Really, I can't um, categorize it for certain people. I feel like if you take the time to actually get into it, anyone could really enjoy it. But maybe there will be some people out there who wouldn't enjoy it, so just figure out for yourself. It could either be one of the greatest things you ever find, or something that may have taken a little bit of time, but it's no big deal. As for me, I think it's weird as hell, but I like it. And I can see why other people like it. I can see why it's becoming this big fandom. It's really original. I've never seen anything like it. And I'm sure I'll grow to like it as much as Austin and Mitzi do if what they say about the trolls are true. I um, still got a lot of reading left to do, but so far, so good.